question is about, uh, see the Prime Minister has asked his independent ethics advisor to look into the tax affairs of the Conservative Party Chairman Nadim Zahawi. Um, I'm interested in your views on that, but also specifically, I seem to recall the SNP saying that you were committed to publish your tax returns annually for the entire duration of your tenure as First Minister. And uh, correct me if I'm wrong, I don't think we've had them routinely throughout that period. Um, I'll take that question first and then I'll come on to uh, the former Chancellor. Um, no, you haven't. I mean, you can judge this uh, in whichever way you want. I've perhaps had other things uh, to deal with over uh, recent years. And given that, and I appreciate this is relevant to what I'll come on to say, uh, you needn't necessarily take this on my word, but my salary as First Minister is my only income. So, you know, if any of you are getting excited about what you might see in my tax returns, I would caution you against it because there isn't anything in my tax returns other than my, you know, publicly known uh, salary. But that said, well, you let me finish the, the question uh, or the answer to your question. Yes, I mean, we're coming up to the end of uh, this tax year. Um, and, you know, when we pass the end of this tax year into February, I will publish uh, the tax return um, so that what I've just said there you can see uh, is absolutely the case. And I also recognise that while tax affairs are in the, the news. In fact, I would, uh, I think my recollection is correct here that when um, I previously published a, a tax return, I think it was when there were questions around David Cameron's tax affairs at the time. So um, when these things are in the news, I think it is, uh, and I'm going to come on to comment about Nadim Zawai's uh, own tax affairs, so it's, it's appropriate. So yes, when I get the administrative uh, sides of, side of that uh, sorted, I will, I will do that. Um, on uh, the former Chancellor, yeah, I'd note what the Prime Minister has said, which you know, seems to me to be more about kicking it into the long grass than uh, addressing it. I think his position, the former Chancellor's position, is untenable. Um, I think he should resign uh, his current position as chair of the Conservative Party. It seems to be the case, and uh, I'll be corrected if I'm wrong here, but I think this is now beyond any uh, real question that while he was Chancellor, he settled a, a seven-figure uh, tax bill with HMRC, which included a very significant penalty. Um, now, that means, as far as I can see, that there must have been something untoward about his tax affairs to a very large tune in terms of the amount of money involved. So I think somebody who is a government minister in that position, I just think their position is, is untenable. So I would uh, think he should uh, resign uh, his post. And if he